I'm Mark Tufnell, I'm the Vice President of the CLA and I'm here on this amazing afternoon to encourage you to go out and count birds on your farm as part of the big farm and bird initiative that uh, we're promoting. Now, I've come out to this particular site because I've got a whole series of habitats here. I've got on my right hand side, I've got some wild bird cover. We've then got arable cultivated margin and a track which we've been supplementary feeding for HLS purposes. We've also got a hedgerow. This one in the foreground has been trimmed. There's a lot of activity there with some very small farm and birds. And further beyond it, there's a hedge that we coppiced some years ago that's come back and we've already seen some yellow hammers down there. The wide open fields of Cotswolds and there's a beetle bank on my left here and it's got a central beetle bank and on either side we've got conservation headland and a wild bird cover strip. And we've already seen three pairs of English grey partridge which is extremely exciting for me because that's something that we've been trying to promote and encourage over the years. Only requires half an hour of your time. You have to take a good pair of binoculars with you. Each here, guide sheet to the type of birds that we're keen for everybody to spot. There's the red leg partridge which will be more common. You may or may not see starlings, skylarks, they're out in the middle of an arable field. Chaffinch, very very pretty, most people know what a chaffinch looks like. Just spend half an hour making a record of the key number of birds that you've seen. Just count them off, tick them off um, and send them off. I think what's relevant is just think about where you're going to go, what time of day and what weather conditions you want. We've come on a lovely sunny day it's the afternoon, it's half past three. We put some feed out this morning and you can see in the hedgerows there are an awful lot of birds there. I'd say it's probably better first thing in the morning or towards the end of the afternoon when the birds are feeling comfortable. I don't recommend going out on a windy or a very wet day because they'll be tucked away in these, either in the hedgerows or stuck right down the bottom of the grass margins. Make yourself comfortable and if you don't chat away too much like I'm doing to you then hopefully you'll see some birds. Thank you.